So I've gone and found this great little kitchen on Revit City. It's made up of different components and casework and all assembled together for me, ready to put into my file. So I'm going to click load into project to load that into my file. So now I'm going to try to place that kitchen. I can hit space to rotate and you can see it doesn't quite match my kitchen layout having these bar stools over here. What we can do when we get components like this is double click on it to go back to the family editor and we can now come along and remove parts of it. So for example I'm going to drag around these items here because I don't want them. I also want to remove these three bar stools. Now, the next thing I want to do is I want to come up here go save as and save the current family. In this case I'm going to call it complete kitchen wall side. Once that's done I can load into project and it's ready for me to place. So I'll delete this previous one first and then I can come along and reselect it and replace it into my kitchen. And that's a little bit more suitable for my current space. Let's say I want some of the other parts from that kitchen. I can go back into my file I downloaded, reopen that. And this time I want to keep these three cupboards up here to put up on the wall. So I can come along and select everything I want to delete. And I'll remove this bottom one as well. And now I'm just left with those three cupboards. So again, I need to come up here and make sure I'm saving as. And call this one complete kitchen wall cab. Load that into my project. And you can see there, this time my selection point is quite a distance away from my cupboards. So let's just get it in the right orientation. I'm going to place those, escape, select those cupboards, use the move to select somewhere a little bit easier to control, for example the back of the cupboards, pull them up against the wall, now I'm going to move them down to about here, go back into my 3D view and I've now got a lot of cabinets. If I wanted to line these up a little bit easier I can just use this align tool here and align these faces like so. You can see that this one's still a little bit away from the wall because I didn't finally tune my kitchen and make that against the wall. So that's how we can use components off of Revit City to take little bits out that we want or even rearrange the configuration.